RaleighPresidentsDay.com here with Teen Girls basketball head coach Shanae Clark. Coach, you guys come out with a tough 35 to 31 victory over Immaculate Hearts night. You know it's a close one down at the end. And coming into it, you guys had suffered two straight losses. What was the mentality for the girls coming into it after those two tough losses? It's it's mainly coming ready to play, mm -hmm. and um, they they understood and learned from their mistakes on Tuesday because some weren't ready, some didn't come ready. Some you can't take teams for granted, and. Um, they had to redeem themselves, and that's what I told them. I was like, this game, when it comes to county seating and everything, we have to win the games we're supposed to win mm -hmm. and prepare and still work hard regardless of who we play. And um, they understood that. Mm -hmm. I was stressing defense, you know, because we gave up a lot of points, and we never did that this entire season. And um, stressed defense in practice again yesterday, and they came out and had a great defensive first quarter. Mm -hmm. And that's a, thank God for that first quarter because that's what gave us the lead. <laughs> no, yeah, you guys were up 15 to four there after the first quarter. Held them at eight total points in the first half, and they're a very talented team. They have players, you know, Jordan Wilmoth and others. What was the defensive focus for you guys coming into it? Well, our defensive focus is to make sure we had help side. Mm -hmm. um, we know each other, um, our opponent's weakness, so I definitely wanted to pressure the ball. And um, because they had bigs, we had to make sure we were there for help. Um, and they just backed each other up tonight, and that's the two neck basketball that. Like, our fans are used to seeing. Mm -hmm. So um, they, under, they understood what was needed to be done for tonight. Then last thing I got for you is there, towards the end, it was a very close game. They had a, a chance to tie it, but you guys really mm -hmm. stepped it up defensively. How you guys? How were you guys able to get it done there late and uh, capture the W? Pass outs. <laughs> Usually, uh, we've been shooting, oh, 64, 60% mm -hmm. as a team from the foul line. And I said, we can't have that anymore. We have to shoot at least 75% from the free throw or more mm -hmm. um, from our, with our team. And um, I said, when we had that opportunities of free points, take a deep breath and knock them down. And that's what it came down to, our defense and foul shots. Okay, great. Thank you so much, Coach. All right, no problem.